Hello, I'm Martin Freeman, and the show that I've just been recording is Decades, where I take a little stroll through my record collection from the 60s up to the present day, the 10s, let's say, and I play three hours per decade of some of my favourite music. If I had to give you one track from each decade for a mixtape, uh, I would resist doing that, obviously, but if I really had to, off the top of my head, I would say from the 60s, I'd give you Pata Pata by Miriam McCabe. From the 70s, let's have um, Heart of Glass by Blondie. From the 80s, uh, let's have um, Rip It Up by Orange Juice. 90s, gosh, uh, Tender by Blur. The noughties, from the noughties, I think I play uh, Bingo by M.I.A. And from the tens, Boys in the Better Land. I might give um, Sound and Colour by Alabama Shakes from this last decade to... Maybe I'd give it to Mick and Keith of The Stones and say, listen to some good music from 50 years' time. It's not exactly stonesy music, but it's got, you know, it contains common elements of R&B. And uh, I think Alabama Shakes is a version of just very, very modern, sort of the best modern R&B-based music. I think their reaction would be, who are you, and why are you dressed like you're from the future? <laughs> and what is this funny thing you've just given me? It isn't on a 12 inch piece of plastic. <laughs> and you better be selling me some gear, or this is a waste of our time and yours. Um, well, I, I could give any album, I think from Rubber Soul onwards, I would give any album by the Beatles to uh, Justin Bieber. <laughs> I think quite a lot of people actually, I think there are probably a few people who don't know the Beatles. Very well. People are making music now. Um, and they don't have to, you know, I'm not a Beatles fascist, but um, I, don't, I, don't, they'll, I think they will enrich anyone's musical life, regardless of the style of music that you perform. So, you know, maybe I'd give a revolver to Little Sims, there you go. Uh, if I had uh, my own Christmas party and I could invite any of these artists to it, uh, I'd need a big place, because I'm playing a lot of records. There's. 18 hours of music that I'm playing. Um, well, I know Alabama Shakes a good company. Debbie Harry, I'd like to invite her for reasons that are mainly musical. Wine House would be a good laugh. You know. The Stones would be a good laugh. I mean, Macca. Macca's good in a, in a room, I think. He could chat to Elvis Costello and Paul Weller. You know, I feel like Paul just so Paul could feel uneasy about that many people in the world. If I had uh, a Martin Freeman Christmas party, I would invite as few people as possible from my playlist. Because uh, I'd either be overawed by them and intimidated by them and not speak to them, um, or some of them might get a bit out of hand. This year, a track that really has got me very excited is uh, a song called Tonight You Might by Cynthia featuring Lady Ray. It's a great classic, well not classic, it's a great modern soul record. And, uh, uh, love. I first heard it on Six Music and it's a wonderful tune. Six Music.